Yes. Yes. Working. Things are good. Yeah. Things are great. <clears throat> Things are not fucking great. I hate everything. I'm raging so hard right now. Okay. If you want me, it's okay. I just sprinkled. It's okay. Hello, I am Gamer. I'm Gamer. And we are back with the. Um, a, 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 a link to the Ocarina of Minish Cap. Oh. Of ages and all, of course. So, apparently, my recording software wanted to be fucking dick. Stop, 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 stop. I sprinkle on you. I sprinkle on you. I can't. I can't get away. I can't. Get Wait, what does the ice rock do to them? Is it supposed to freeze them? <laughs> it didn't do anything. <laughs> it just sorry. bounced off of them. I'm sorry. I thought it was going to do some damage. <laughs> Yeah, I'm um, the worst player ever. <laughs> there we go. Oh, a chest. A chest. A chest. chest. So yeah, apparently um, my uh, game recorder apparently wanted to record the audio program instead of the video. So now we literally have no video of what just happened in the last episode. And now everyone's going to be like, wait, why are they in Hyrule Castle? They didn't even do Death Mountain. Fuck you and fuck your horse. I mean, you could just, you know, put the audio and have some pictures. That's so gay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hello. Gamer. So, basically, to sum up what happened, unless I can figure out some sort of life hack on this situation, we went to Death Mountain, we killed the boss thing, um, we fucking did stuff, we went and got the Master Sword, and now we're here. And we're gonna fight Aghanim. I got the button down. I got the Why is that really cool? Isn't there some sort of like Greek literature or something like that? I think so, yeah. Yeah, I'm like some into Greek, Greek theater and I suck at that. I know he's a king. Something like that. We did, um... <laughs> in my theater 2 class, we did like a... Oedipus. We did Oedipus. Oh gosh. Oedipus really was the first motherfucker. He was. <laughs> he was his own motherfucker. God. Which makes it worse. Stop. Or better, depending on what your yeah. um, sexual preference is. Man, when we were in Florida, we... Uh, I saw this guy, he's not even a guy, he's a child, this child, obviously a baby. Whenever you start off with a story with a deep sigh, you just know it's going to be a great story. Please continue. <laughs> so, we were in line at Universal, well, not Universal, I was an adventure, this water ride, and this guy and his friends, who was joking around, but they thought it would be funny, because as we're walking, we go up, uh -huh. and stuff like that, and when you look down below, you see all the people who just got off the water ride, you know, like, oh my gosh, we got so wet, ha ha ha, so the kid thought it would be funny to spit his ice cubes at the people walking below us, below us. And I was like, what the hell? Are you serious? That's so fucking nasty. <laughs> and he keeps doing it. And so... There's this older lady with them. And I was just like, is she not gonna say anything? Because she clearly saw them do it. Yeah. And... I was like, she's not gonna say anything. Because she's a white lady who doesn't know how to control fucking kids. She's expressing myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So... Fucking die. What the fuck? I was just talking to my friends, and I was like, you know, it'd be kind of funny if she wasn't a mom, and she was a lover of one of kids. Like, <laughs> a mom, like, a milk kind of situation. And I was like, yeah, hey, it's And so... We go further in the line, and the kid gets ice cubes again and spits it out at the people. 
And so Dwight finally says something like, can you stop? That's really gross. You've been doing that for like 15 minutes. Like, cut it out. That's disgusting. And then the lady is like, no, I tell them, they just don't listen. And I just look at him like, I can't tell your children. Yeah. So... Aren't you a parent? So... Ten minutes pass. And... I just happen to look over. And one of the kids, who was of age, um, it leans closer to the older lady and I grab your butt. And then I'm just like, Oh my what? god! <laughs> and then they try to be inconspicuous and then clearly not because then I see it and they just give each other a kiss on the mouth. So I was like, oh! Oh my god! So I was right! Oh my god! <laughs> she, I was not expecting that at all! Was, she was there! With her lover of a teenager who's clearly 18. And. Ah! <laughs> and she. I was hoping to be here to witness the queen. Brought, and he brought his friends over with his hot girl smile. That's great. No, please. That's a perfect voice, Dragon. Ah! Queef! <laughs> I'm glad you were here to witness me, Queef! Why is he Luigi? <laughs> the power of the Triforce! <laughs> 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 and this one? No. And this one? No. Oh, look, I'm a genius. <laughs> it's the other one. It's the other one. Aga. Oh. oh! So you mean to say you would like to be totally destroyed? But I can make your wish come true. Whoa, totally destroyed. <laughs> oh no, how could you find my secret hideout? Bitches. Behind this curtain. Do you have to play tennis with it? Oh, you do! do. Is he not again? Bah! No, he's... Spoilers! Tam, spoilers. Oh, come on! It's fucking Zelda! <laughs> yes, technically he is Ganon. But he's not Ganon until after you get to the end of the game. And then he's like, oh, my final form! Even though his plan's totally foiled because then you've rescued the Seven Maidens and then Oak Lightning. And then he's like, oh, you foiled my plan! How dare you! Let me turn into my true form and shit on you now! Yeah, because that's, that's how it's supposed to work. Speaking of your ice story, though, there's one girl that I dated when I was in high school. Um, she literally was life. She was perfect. Um, so, on Loch Ness Monster, the first time we wrote it together, because we went to Bush Gardens like a lot of And um, she was like, you know, okay, well, um, I'm going to teach you something super cool. I was like, okay. Gets on Loch Ness Monster, he's like, okay, when we go into the first loop, you're about to witness magic. She goes in, the first loop, when you go upside down, she had timed it down to a T, the perfect moment to spit straight downwards in the loop, and it would hit the, first, the person in the very last card. Are you serious? Yes. She <laughs> had it timed perfectly, <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, please marry me. <laughs> That's impressive, but damn. Yeah. Gah! Well met, like the true hero that you are, but I'm not ready to admit defeat yet. I will draw you into the dark world. Even though, yeah. you, have, even though you have the moon pearl, and I will literally do nothing to you. Can we already go to the dark world? Queef, it is I, Sarasalasala. I'm meeting to you across the void through telepathy. The place where you know. Who else is. Oh, whatever. I'm not even gonna go there. Who else can we find? Yeah, like who else? My has been speaking to me telepathically throughout this entire game. My quad. Uh, my quad. To win back the Golden Palace, I must also rescue the Seven Maidens who are hanging in sent to the Dark Wall. I must have the bloodline of the Seven Wise Men. They have power that will surely help you. The maidens are locked in, in dungeons full of evil creatures and dangerous traps. The Palace of Darkness should be a first goal in this world. Queef, I can rely only on you. Please make this old man's wishes come true. <laughs> I beg you. Please, Queef. Oh, oh, he's saying your name. Yeah. Oh, please. please, Queef. Please. Please, Queef on my face. Please it's please. one of my many fetishes. Oh my! <laughs> Beep. 
I love how they're like, oh, let's be super creative and literally make the first dungeon in the Dark World the exact same as the first dungeon in Light World because we gave us lots of thought. These trees look so sad. I'm sorry, trees. A little bit of my mind. <sighs> okay, let's see if I can remember how to navigate through the forest maze. There's stuff in here. Stuff. There's stuff. There's stuff. And there's a shoot, there's a shoot, a wolf! Yes. That. That thing. Shoot a Udo! Shoot a Udo! Oh, it's just hearts. That's worthless. Oh, has, um... <laughs> have you learned about Poop Dollar yet? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. So, our, one of our managers at work, who will not be named, um, told me about one of the greatest games you can play ever at theme parks, and it's called Poop Dollar. You literally take a dollar, and you go to the bathroom, and you take a shit, and you wipe your butt with the dollar, and then you leave it on the ground, and wait for somebody to pick it up, and you like hide behind something nearby, and as soon as somebody bends over and picks it up, you jump out from behind whatever it is, and go, POOP DOLLAR! <laughs> and then you go back into hiding and you just wait for multiple people to walk by and pick up the same dollar and watch them well, well just watch their face of utter disgust as they realize that they just touched a dollar that was in between some butt cheeks <laughs> and could possibly have shit on it I'm Kiki the monkey Kiki I love rupees more than anything other than my name Kiki can you spare me 10 rupees Give him ten. I like how it says, "Give him ten rupees" or "Give him nothing ever." Kiki. 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 Oh, that just came out way too nerdy. I should just never talk about it. Oh, oh. oh no! What? Oh, you killed my monkey, you bitch. And then you killed me. You die. I did you die. die. I spanked the monkey too hard and died. Oh gosh. I'm a very passionate man. That's intense. That's very intense. That's why I have so many lovelies. <laughs> I love how you just go back into the woods and he's like back. He's like, ah, Kiki, give me more rupees. I ran away like a pussy, but I'm gonna charge you 10 rupees again. Kiki! Really? Yeah. Wow. Such nice. And then you get to the little door in the dungeon and he's like, I'll charge you 100 rupees to let you in. You oh, give me a hundred okay. rupees, I will open the entrance for you. Mm -hmm. Ask him to open it. Try to open it yourself. What the fuck am I gonna do? Good choice. Then I get a hundred of your rupees. Why don't I have to fucking rub it in? Mm -hmm. You need to do your best. Your best. Thing. It's never been done. But in I look, 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 look. It's way the same. Almost none of it changed at all. Period. It's almost the exact same dungeon. <laughs> Oh, wait, it did change. The entrance is the only thing that's different. Because now there's like different paths you can go down, because before like the bridges were broken. Okay, okay. 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 These are the anti fairies. So when the area anti fairies come at you, you you you, 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 you sprinkle them with a the magic powder, oh, and they, they turn, turn into a regular fairy. fairy. They turn into a regular fairy. And avoid you, fairy. Like ah ha! Please don't eat me. Please, master. Oh, ha, ha, ha. What? Why? Oh, that was 
absolutely pointless. Absolutely. Oh, that's why it is. <sighs> Thank you. What is that triangle? The triangle. Triangle. That's how Saranga lost a lot. Chops to you telepathic. Yes. Yeah. Dumb. Oh, All these fucking guys. Yeah, I'm gonna help you out. Oh gosh. They mirror your movements, so you literally just have to like corner them until they can't run. And then you just kill them. Except the last guy. Except the last guy, because then he shoots lasers at you, so you literally have to like. Yeah. Hearts. Arrows. Oh, jeez. Oh. All or nothing. Need for speed. Six. Fast and furious. Tokyo Drift. Uh, I what? went. What did you say? I went through all of that for a fucking half. Why would you say that? Oh. That movie does not exist. We just pretend it's not a thing. It is a Hey, look, I found a Failies! That's convenient because I lost my other slaves. I mean, fairies. They're not slaves. Look, that's what you did. You ate it. Why all I have to do is leave and come home. Ah ha 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 Looks like it's a secret thing, but it's not actually a secret thing, and then you just fall down and die. That's stupid. They try to trick you. They think they're, well, they think they're sneaky. Well, if that ever is a thing, I'm just gonna laugh at you. Hey ya! Hey ya! Hey ya! Button? Hi -ya. Button! Button! <laughs> now there's. Yeah, see this one? Now this is the thing that you blow up and fall on everything. Oh, so what's on the other side? The other one is, um, not a thing. I think, I'm fairly certain this is where they keep this. I like it. Oh, I really hope this is the big key yes. I was gonna say, I really hope this is the big key and not the compass, otherwise I'm gonna be upset. How upset? So upset. Ooh, another key. Uh, 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 Why can't I use the teleporter? Because you have too many things happening. The game got confused. I was like, oh, what, the, what the fuck is happening? You lose. Use confusion. Confused, there we go. It was super effective. Okay, so now. That one, that one, that way. And then that way. Even though I don't have rocks feather, which isn't even in this game. Right? Hey, those monsters appear in Majora's mass. They do. Majora. Majora. I've never been near Majora. Look at that. There's Charmanders everywhere. Oh god, my tail's on fire. Oh my god, tail's on fire. Charmander, give me that. Smell. 
<laughs> ten penguins did it together. Okay, One there's fish, two fish, three fish, three dildo. Fish. Oh, red fish. Oh, I don't remember what it is. There's just keys everywhere, and I'm finding them all. Just like I catch all the Pokemon. Even though I'm totally... I don't even play Pokemon to catch all of them, I just catch the ones that I want. Magic hammer. Magic hammer. Oh, you can use all those little things. Yeah, you smash it. See, and... Yeah. I like how they're, they're... It's really sad because their faces are like really happy and then they're like, SMASH! Well, that's how it is in all the little... Hot squirrels. <laughs> We're gonna invent a Zelda game that's just like multiple Zelda worlds all fused together. It would be called The Legend of Zelda Skyward. <laughs> Skyward. Oh, smash! Skyward Minish. It's really sad how you can like just do this. Like the poor little spike thing is like. Okay. Bye.